Is he around there? Yeah, Do you reckon the jackals took this down or somebody else? Um, we think a cheetah did this. Oh, that cheetah we're looking for. Yeah. Between when we saw them and when we got back, the cheetah took him. Predators, simply because if he gets injured, there's no one to look after him. So instead of getting involved in a fight and end up getting themselves injured, they'd rather just try and hunt again. But look at him. The, hmm? <laughs> the warthog is actually still alive, but already. The hyenas feeding on his intestines. They don't actually kill their prey, they just feed on their prey while it's still alive, while it's still kicking. These guys. There are other oh. hyenas over here? No. Pardon? There are other hyenas here? Yeah, no, there's many hyenas around. So there could, more and more hyenas could start moving into the area here. I guess maybe the leopard is just waiting for him to reduce the weight for him. And then when he moves, he'll go and try to steal it and take it up a tree. Because at the moment, it's still too big for him to take up a tree. It's too heavy. One more in the sun. Mm. 
Mariano, pobre. Sí. <laughs> what actually attracted the hyena is the noise that the warthog was making. Actually, it was even more vocal before we got here. When I was talking to the guy on the radio, I could hear it squealing on the radio. Because it's, it's quite an effort to try and take down such a big warthog for a leopard, so it's, they're not the easiest of prey for them. And they utilize these, uh, there's some big holes around this big termite mount that warthogs would use as shelter. So you may find that the leopard has just been waiting there for the warthogs to come out. And eventually the warthog tried to come out, he managed to catch him that way. Sometimes they'll even wait the whole night there if he knows there's a water because he knows eventually the water would have to come out to go and graze. So if you'll just stay in there for the whole night. Yeah, the leopard must be tired now, especially from fighting with this water for quite some time. So it's just regaining some oxygen, regaining some energy while letting this hyena reduce the weight of the kill. And then he'll go, he'll go and try to, to, to scavenge it from him. It's quite a big animal, so chances are he's, the hyena is not going to finish that off. As soon as he's full, he might leave it. Unless more hyenas move into the area, then that would be a problem for the leopard. But if it, no other hyenas would come in here, there'll still be something. For